Hey, what's up, Predator fans? This is Marcus, the Predator enthusiast from Austria, Vienna, and I just wanted to give you a quick look at the uh, random made uh, move Predator mask I got since, let's say, October, November. I don't, can't remember anymore. It's um, actually the same um, mask that Sideshow used, and there's a guy in Hong Kong who repaints those masks and uses another st uh, style of, of base. Uh, take a little look at that. That's the Claymore or Trap, the Wolf Brother um, uses to in the sewer scene to catch some aliens. And as you can see here probably, the likeness of them mask itself is pretty cool. I like the mask. I prefer it to all other masks outside like the P2 or P1. Uh, I also got the Celtic and I will do a quick video on that. And um, uh, why is this mask so special is about the, the ornament he has on the helmet. And um, this is something very unique compared to others. Probably the Celtic is also very unique to other masks like outside. And well, um, I just wanted to give a little shout out to Nanny D from Switzerland because he repainted the Berserker Celtic mask and the uh, P1, P2 and he did a fabulous job so uh, big applause to you Nanny because this work was incredible also and yeah so let's start with the video concerning this mask so if you're keen on getting one of those I would recommend you to get this one to start uh, because um, the amount of detail is will blow you away. I don't know if this guy on Hong Kong still has some masks of that. Uh, when I bought this one, this was the this uh, the, he had two left. Yeah, but uh, anyway, take a look on eBay. He does some very good job, and he also got the uh, Inch Predator mask that I will get soon the next year in January. The only thing that bothers me buying from Hong Kong is it's just the shipping cost and the, the fees you have to pay here in Europe. That's very, very much. It's not the item itself because the US dollar is, um, is a benefit to European buyers. But anyway, um, I appreciate the, the amount of, 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 of work, of hard work, putting in that piece. And it's in my room with all my collectibles. It's some kind of centerpiece because it's um, it catches your eye. So enough talk. Um, I wish you also a very nice start of the next year, 2014. Uh, for <laughs> for Predator fans, it's going to be a cool year because Hot Toys are relaunching the. Um, uh, the, the yellow predator it looks pretty cool compared to the original one and uh, the uh, predator 2 I guess cinema cat or what is the name called it's very expensive one thousand two hundred dollars looks pretty damn cool but I didn't made up my mind yet to buy it because that's very expensive but I'm looking forward to new collectibles coming out next year so have a nice year um, stay healthy and uh, subscribe subscribe to my videos if you want to goodbye folks goodbye